Here is your latest update brought to you by Weather Follower. Get tropical updates throughout the season so you never run out of information. Subscribe so you don't miss a thing. Tropical cyclone Darien has formed in the far eastern Indian Ocean just west of the Cocos Islands. According to the Australian scale, Darien is currently a Category 1 storm. Here are the current stats and statistics of Darien on the right here. On infrared radar it certainly has the circular shape of a tropical cyclone. But at this stage thunderstorm activity is not flaring up around the center, which is where it needs to be to help strengthen this cyclone. This will likely start getting better organized soon as the Australian bomb are forecasting it to strengthen into a Category 2 system or a severe tropical storm or tropical cyclone if you're used to the Mauritius measuring system for tropical cyclones. This system will be moving in a generally westward direction over its lifetime towards Mauritius and Reunion as well as Rodrigues. This shown above in the latest spaghetti plots for the system. However, we can also see that the lines are very space apart. This highlights the huge amount of uncertainty with the exact track this cyclone is likely to take. It could exit down to the south pretty soon or continue traveling west maintaining its strength. It is looking likely though that the system will start to weaken as it nears the islands of Mauritius, Reunion and Rodrigues. So impacts there at this stage look very minimal to none as the track forecast is still up in the air, as just discussed. This westerly track and even intensity is evident when we look at the JTWC forecast cone. As it shows the strength staying roughly similar around 50 to 60 knots for a couple of days before it makes its westward track where at this stage it looks likely to maintain or start to strengthen again. I will be posting tropical updates all season long. In between videos I may post smaller updates or questionnaires on my community tab. I have also left a link to my Instagram account in my about section or YouTube banner depending on what device you watch my forecasts on. This is so you can get extra small updates if you prefer Instagram over YouTube. I'd like to thank everyone for all of the support you've given my channel over the past years and I hope I can continue to update you on the channel for many many years to come. That's all for the moment. Subscribe for more videos like this in the years to come so you never run out. See you soon.